Hey there, I'm meteorologist Tom Kippen. We'll start off our Saturday with sunshine, but clouds will be on the increase. Here comes the rain as we go in the Saturday night, and we're going to keep the rain going as we go into the daytime hours on Sunday. Best rain chances closer to the Wisconsin border and also near the Lake Michigan shoreline, tapering off towards the Keweenaw Peninsula. Rain showers are going to stick around through Sunday night, and then I think on Monday we do start to get some clearing. Here's your extended forecast. Marquette and Marquette County temperatures will be in the 60s inland, but around 50 along Lake Superior. 40s to around 50 for Sunday. That's it with some rain and wind and then improving weather for Monday. For the eastern UP, we're looking at temperatures in the 60 degree range inland around 50 though near Lake Superior. A chilly and wet day for Sunday with some wind. Some morning rain shower chances on Monday, but improvement does start Monday afternoon. For the Escanaba area and along Lake Michigan, we'll start to get the clouds in here for Saturday afternoon. 60s inland, 50s closer to Lake Michigan and the Bay of Green Bay and then a very cool wet and at times gusty winds for Sunday and then for Monday we'll have some morning rain showers but improving Monday afternoon for the interior west we'll have temperatures in the 60s for Saturday 50s for Sunday and then improving weather for Monday and then if you're noticing on all of these we're looking at warmer temperatures especially for inland areas on Tuesday and also Wednesday so that's going to feel nice but until then and Saturday for the Keweenaw Peninsula, 60s inland, around 50 closer to Lake Superior. And then we'll have a chilly wet and at times we'll have to deal with the wind on Sunday. But here comes the weather improvement for Monday. Here's your marine forecast for the Bay of Green Bay and Lake Michigan. Waves a foot or less for South Central Lake Superior. We're looking at waves that will be a foot or less. And then for the Keweenaw Peninsula, we're looking at waves one to two feet for Keweenaw Bay and also Ontonagon, but towards Eagle Harbor and Copper Harbor, a foot or less.